Hey guys, All In Crypto here and welcome back for another YouTube video guys. First of all, let me start off by saying Happy New Year to you all. I hope you all had a good festive period. Um, I hope you made the most of whatever the situation was that you uh, found yourselves in. Um, I feel like I say this way too often, but let me apologize first off for not making a video in the last sort of seven days. I've been away. I haven't had the facilities really, um, and I don't just want to put out junk for you guys. I actually want to put out content that has some sort of substance and some sort of worth and, um, you know, value, value to it. Um, so guys, today I really want to talk about the price prediction that I made of Bitcoin hitting a hundred thousand dollars. Now looking extremely likely. When I've made the price prediction, Bitcoin's price was sat at around nineteen thousand dollars. We hadn't even smashed the all-time highs. Uh, the video, of course, is Bitcoin to a hundred thousand dollars in twenty twenty-one. Um, that that come out on the fourteenth. Usually, I make videos a couple of days sort of prior. Um, and then once I've looked over, I might upload them. Bitcoin today is set at 39,000, guys. We are absolutely smashing it. If you haven't made money in this time period, I really don't know what to say. Stellar Lumens is killing it. Cardano is killing it. Are we going to see a fight for this sort of fourth place um, with all the sort of bad news that XRP has received? I'm not hating on XRP. I love XRP. I'm still in XRP. I just think that they are, there's a greater sort of plan at work here. That's for another video. I'm going to release sort of a, a conspiracy video around XRP. Um, but in this video, guys, I really sort of want to reiterate the fact that Bitcoin is indeed going to $100,000. And really, uh, we're talking about the four-year cycle theory here and how Bitcoin is still following that. Um, when we hadn't sort of passed the all-time highs and entered the new year, with the turn of the new year, it's almost like a magical effect that it has where it's like the start pistol to the race of Bitcoin's sort of parabolic stage and, and, and the wider crypto market sort of parabolic stage. Every four years, we have a parabolic stage. Quickly as a breakdown, the first year is the, 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 the year that follows the parabolic stage where we enter the bear market. It's usually a sharp decline. Second year, we bottom out. Third year, we really start the bull market again. We sort of uh, break all sort of descending resistances. And then the fourth year is where we see that parabolic stage take place. And we are currently in the fourth year. And Bitcoin has performed uh, accordingly. Um, we are going to see a pullback at some point. When that pullback is going to be, is going to be very hard to sort of tell. Um, we didn't see it in 2013 until later on. In 2017, we saw it quite quite early on, um, and then more consistently, then we we only really had the sort of one in 2013. Um, pullbacks are common. You treat them as a buying opportunity, guys. Um, it's a good time to accumulate. We are going up from here. Like I say, $100,000 I think is very, very conservative. I do believe we are going to surpass that. However, for now, I'm putting $100,000 on the table as um, a sure bet. I'm not 100% sure, of course. Nothing in life is, is, is certain. However, I'm as close to sure and certain as I could possibly be about this, guys. Cryptocurrencies are going to revolutionize the world. I've known this since I put money into them three years ago. Like I say, with the sort of overall market that's taking place at the moment, um, I was actually helping a number of people uh, to get into the crypto market. And a, a lot of those people were actually putting money into Stellar. Some even, um, you know, a, a, as close to its sort of big pump as the day before and actually as it was pumping. So imagine that, guys, your first experience with the crypto market, you one and a half X your your initial investment, guys. So the crypto market is truly a magical place. It happens to be the year of the ox, which is basically a bull. I was bullish before I heard this. Um, however, I'm more bullish now. Uh, I'm joking. I just thought that was an interesting thing to maybe throw in the video for those of you who didn't know it was the year, Chinese year of the ox. Um, the price predictions that we have coming out at the moment are just, you know, this is a conservative one of $220,000. We have ones that... 400,000, 500,000, a million, just insane uh, price predictions are getting thrown around at this time. You guys really need to be careful. Um, I, I don't want to say don't be greedy, 
Greed is not always a bad thing. It can pay off. But just be very, very careful, guys. We are going to see pullbacks and we are going to see um, you know, us coming potentially out of the uh, bull market. When that will be, well, do we go for a multi-year sort of stage four? It's possible. Could it go on for two years? The difference with this sort of um, fourth stage of, uh, of the sort of four-year cycle is that we have real institutions involved at the moment, not just institutions, you know, hedge funds. We've got um, companies, corporates, banks, in some cases, governments. Um, the, it, this 2017 was really driven on sort of FOMO and um, sort of retail um, FOMO. This is, is a whole different animal. Um, it, the volatility is back, guys. I hope you're all excited. Please don't trade with leverage uh, because you w it's a very sure way to get wrecked. Yes, there is the opportunity to make money there, um, but there's also the opportunity to lose a hell of a lot. You know, I wouldn't recommend. I don't recommend tra trading the crypto market. Full stop. I don't do that. I invest um, over time and have been doing so throughout the entirety of the bear market. Um, and I'm going to continue to do so, guys. I am going to come up with a 500, potentially a 500 crypto pound cha crypt cryptocurrency challenge or a 2,500 cryptocurrency challenge where I'm going to take that money and try and turn 500 pounds into 10,000 pounds throughout this sort of year. I'm giving myself a year to do so just to kind of prove that it is, you know, a doable thing. And I'm putting my money where my mouth is. I'm not just telling you guys to do something that I wouldn't. I'm leading from the front. So to speak. So guys, you're in for a treat. Bitcoin is definitely or as close to definitely as I could get going to hit $100,000 uh, in my view. Hang tight. A pullback is coming. When that pullback's going to be, we don't know. The pullback could come at 100,000, it could come at 50, it could come now. It could nobody knows for certain. Maybe the sort of sculptors and the, and the, and the micro traders, uh, you know, the people that aren't looking at macro might have a bit more of an insight of that. I'm not really a trader. I do take some short-term trades, but only trades that I'm, uh, there's a high probability of paying off. Um, remember, more traders lose money than make by a significant portion. I think it's about 90%. And even the traders that make money lose a hell of a lot of their trades. They just have really sh sort of tight stop losses. So that's really it for the video today, guys. Um, like I say, apologies for not making videos as frequently as I'd have liked to. Hang in there. Hold on for dear life, guys. Huddle your coins. Um, we've not... I know it's sort of hard to say this really seen much of an alt season. We are going to see that. The Bitcoin dominance chart is, is looking interesting. It's something I'm paying very close attention to at the moment. Um, but guys, what a fantastic time it is to be in crypto, you know, at the moment. Um, it's been a very long bear market and it's really paying off now, guys. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. I hope being back at work isn't too uh, labor intensive and stressful for you. And I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. Thanks a lot for watching. Please leave a like, a comment, let me know what you think. And subscribe for more videos. And make sure you hit that notification bell, guys, so you get notified when a video comes out. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Have a fantastic day.